Rafa is the most amazingly outgoing, fearless cat I've ever met. Our younger dog is incredibly social. He's shown a ton of interest in cats in a social, playful way. And I just had a feeling that he really needed a, a kitty pal. And so we looked into it and found the right cat and they hit it off right away. So they've all become great friends. Rafa and Guru are inseparable at this point. So the first time he wore a harness was at my house. Uh, he was a little angry at first, but adapted quickly. And because Rubina had pre-adopted him, she dropped one off for me to get him started on it as quick as possible. I think she liked the idea because she could train him as he was younger to want to be on a harness and go on adventures with her. We hoped that he would become an adventure cat. My partner and I, we travel a lot, and the thought of leaving our cat behind while our dog goes out with us sounded awful to both of us, you know? And so you rarely see cats out, and I don't have a lot of experience with cats, and so we didn't know what to expect. So we've been very, very happily surprised with him. Tess and I have both been just so amazed at how many people stop us on the trails to ask about him, to take pictures of him. And so he's kind of gained a little bit of a following on Instagram. It's uh, Rafa and Guru. We try to post all the time, all of his adventures and all the fun things we're doing. So I've been a dog trainer for seven years. I got to know best friends through volunteering for them and uh, helping with their more difficult cases. Training a cat versus training a dog is absolutely different and a huge learning curve for me. He has an amazing food drive and that's been really helpful to help him learn what we want. Uh, we actually didn't know what to expect. I didn't know what that training would look like. It took him a few tries, but as we go out, he just gets more and more adventurous, more and more curious, just loves it. It is a calculated risk to take your cat outside. And so I think knowing your cat uh, having the right cat to do it is is important, I think. But we do try to take precautions to keep him safe. For example, we've never taken him out without each other. My partner and I both go out at the same time, always, and that's so somebody's always watching. And then having a harness on him, a leash on him, and working together as a team. And so taking him outside has been so enriching for him. He lights up when we bring his harness out. He gets excited when we get in the car rides because he knows we're going somewhere, we're gonna go explore. Just out exercising and sniffing and climbing and scratching trees. We don't even have a cat tree at home because he gets all of his needs met. I mean, he's just so happy. I can't imagine not taking him outside at this point. Hopefully we can just keep getting out, exploring and motivating other people to do the same with their cats. You know, I've been a dog person my whole life, obviously working with dogs, living with dogs. When I got a cat, I'm actually really surprised at how in love with him. I mean, I knew I would love him. I love all animals, but I'm just absolutely shocked every day I wake up thinking about him and go downstairs. Rafa and Guru will be on the couch sleeping together because I'm just so excited and in love with him and can't wait to say hi to him in the mornings. It's just been awesome having him. Yeah.